In this problem, we have the complex uh, exponential function, f of z equals e to the z. We have this set i, and we're being asked to find um, the image of i under the function f. So what is f of i? And we will draw a sketch of uh, what that set actually is. So before we do anything, recall that a complex number z can be written as a plus bi. So it's advantageous for us to do that because this set is described that way. So this is a plus bi. Then properties of exponents say we can write this as e to the a times uh, e to the bi. Now we can use Euler's formula to write this as e to the a. And we can replace e to the bi with cosine b plus i sine b. And this will help us uh, when we try to figure out what f of i is. So let's take uh, an element uh, of f of i. So what would that be? So f of i, let's write out the set, is equal to the set right, of all elements of the form uh, f of a plus b i, such that, um, well, uh, if this number is in i, then it means a is 1 and b is a real number. So let's keep going. Let's write this as the set. Well, f is e to the z, right? So that'll be e to the a plus b i, where a is 1 and b is a real number. I probably could have skipped some steps here. I'm uh, pretty much working this out for the first time. Uh, a is 1, so we can go ahead and replace uh, a with 1. So this would be e to the uh, 1 plus bi. And then I've already, we've already used the 1, so I'll just say b is a real number. So I don't have to specify a is 1 again because we've used it. We can use properties of exponents. We can write this as e times e to the bi, right? It's e to the 1, which is just e. And here b is a real number. Beautiful stuff. So this is furthermore equal to the set of all elements of the form e times, and now we can use Euler's as we did above at the beginning, cosine b plus i sine b. So every element, and here b is a real number, so every element uh, in f of i uh, has this form. It's e times cosine b plus i sine b. So cosine b plus i sine b lies on the unit circle, right? So basically if you were to graph just this part here in red, you would get the unit circle. What the E does is it stretches the unit circle. It makes it a circle of radius E, right? So this is E, this is E, this is negative E, and this is negative E. And so what we seem to be getting here is a beautiful circle. Okay, it's supposed to be <laughs> a circle. And the radius here is E. So r is equal to e. And this is the graph of the set uh, f of i. Kind of a cool problem. Um, I hope that helps.